Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. W wait, there's another. Luke. They're coming. Luke. Hang on. What the fuck's going on here? Ha Hang on. What? Is that? Who the sh... Is that Kenny? No. It can't be. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, whoa. Kenny? Whoa, whoa. Please, just do what he says. Kenny! Dude! Am I glad to see you? Kenny! Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? Oh, oh, Kenny, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> oh, dude, I've missed you, Kenny. I've missed you. I'll take that as a yes. These people with you? We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you sure you don't mind? It's going to storm soon. Please, come in. Oh, God, I can't believe it. I can't believe me and Rav's called Kenny. But it's only because we didn't see him die and we thought, like, it's got to be someone like Kenny. And then the hat, I thought... It's got to be, it's, it's a guy, it's clearly a guy. Maybe it's Kenny with a beard, and then it was. Oh man, this is great. So this is what it's like with, I guess, the wind turbines are generating all this. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. Yeah, look at this fucking place. This is amazing. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. No, you are not. You're trigger happy, and I am not having you killing Kenny. Lol. Um. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? Ah, <sighs> yes. If you tell me they're good, then I'm good. Us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. I can't speak for everyone. Now calm down. Beck, it's their home. We're not going to find another place like this tonight. Exactly. Look, a Christmas tree. Not now, Sarah. These guys are fine. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. See, she's okay. They're fine. It's just, it's just, not so much Luke. It's Nick I don't trust. Thank you, Luke. Thank you. It's him. He's the dodgy one. If you get him to put the gun down, it's fine. Oh, thank God. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. Ooh. Well, that's relaxing and relieving. I've, I'll be honest. I'm now at the point now where it's like, I'm with Kenny, so fuck these other people. Uh, apart from if we could find Chris, so that'd be great. Oh, man, look at this. A nice fire. A Christmas duck for some reason. Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh, no. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? I know. Lee saved me. He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. 
I'm going to cry, Kenny, don't. Hell. He was a hell of a guy. Yes, yes, he was. When my son, well, he took care of him. I'll never forget that. Thanks, dude. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. I was with Krista and Omid. Omid, well, Krista and I were together for a while, but these guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. you. Say that. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. Krista, Krista said you were dead. I am. This is all a dream. Don't don't start that. <laughs> sorry, bad joke. Krista got in a hell of a mess. I gave her a hand, and then it got messier. I thought for a minute there, it wasn't looking too good for old Kenny. Long story short. I got lucky. Real lucky. What actually happened? Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita. Thank God. Oh, I'm glad he's found someone. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. I'm glad Kenny's had a sort of happy story. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Come on, Carlos. Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. I sure. love how we've not actually talked about the light situation. That's a bit concerning. Like, come on, there are guys that are going to come up the mountain and they're probably going to come up the mountain at night because they've got torches. But everyone's forgotten about that, including Clem. I'm a bit worried. I can see what's going to happen. Hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? Uh, sure. What are you cooking? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Uh... Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. It's a long story. I think we should just leave it at that. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. What? Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. So, everyone underestimates me. I, that pretty much summarises Clem. I expect you've used that to your advantage. Yes okay. and no. Smart girl. Thank you. Mmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? Uh, sure. What is it? What is this? Le Walter Surprise. An autumnal legume salad with a peach roux. That sounds like ass. It's peaches and beans. That's all we got. So you put them together? Huh. Striking resemblance. Oh, don't start. Why does everyone say I look like the sodding peach girl? Mm-hmm. Also, peaches and beans. Come on, have the beans separate to the peaches. I know that you want some form of taste, but I'm not sure that's the best thing. Maybe it is me. Maybe I am the peaches girl. Let's pick up the CD. Cousin Jared's concert, October 13th, 1998. What year are we in now? I think that's quite old, isn't it? Wow, that's, that's some... Just, just waiting for the music to kick in. Reminds me of school. That's quite calming. I could go for that. OK, let's look. Actually, let's talk to Sarita. I think we'll... Let's, let's get to know them. Hello. Clem, we could use some help. Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. What a great activity, hanging Christmas tree stuff. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. 
But you must be so glad. So, how, how did you meet? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Right? Hold up. You should have seen his beard then. Oh dear. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. Uh, right, find a tree topper. Okay, I... Oh, the duck! Where's the duck gone? Can we put that on the tree? Do 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 Oh, a, a map. Yes, I'll take... I'll look at the map. So, I guess we're at the ski... Oh, okay. I, it's too short. Too short, Clem. Uh... Don't need to look at the fireplace. I would look at it, but I'm... I need to find this tree topper. Ah! How about this? Can we put this on the tree? What a funny little guy. He's not a funny little guy. He's a duck. Don't diss the duck. God damn. Um. Ski shop. Okay, what about... Oh, hang on. This way, Clem. Uh, oh, no. Maybe I can only go up the stairs. I think I can only go up the stairs. Okay, that's fine. Um, we might be able to find a tree topper. I'd assume there'll be something upstairs, right? Oh, what I don't like is this is literally... It's not just the calm before the weather storm. This is the calm before the people coming and invading the lodge storm. It's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? We can't be sure. It, it's, it's them. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. I don't know. We can't be sure. They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? It's easy to track if you know what you're doing. Luke said you saw some people in the valley. I did. People? Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Well, I don't know. Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We talked about... Kenny? They could be hiding something. We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard? Yes. Yeah, that's him. Look, I don't he is trustworthy, him. so don't diss him. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Okay. Honey, I, I don't feel so good. Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. Please tell me you're not gonna give birth. If you give birth, the whole... We're, we're screwed. What's in the box? Oh! We need that for the tree! That for the tree! There we go. Perfect. That's nice, I guess. Oh, fuck off. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. I should probably have Matthew and talked to Sarah. But, oh, God. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. Where? The first time he met me, he called me Rita. Is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. Um... He should be back soon. What if... Matthew... Um, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He does seem a bit different. No, he does seem different. He does seem different than I remember. In what way? I'm not sure. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it, hon. I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Oh, dear. Okay. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Her to fly. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? I feel, yeah. Oh, what if, what if the missing Matthew, is it Matthew and Walter is, yeah, there's something going on. Are you okay? Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I don't know. I mean, 
How can anyone now? I think it's possible. I think it's possible. How do you know? Well, I'm still here. Also, they managed it on Voyager, so, you know, I'm sure we can manage it here. I know it's going to be hard. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. It's a good attitude to have. She's kicking. Want to listen? Uh... That food smells good, huh? Sure. Can I? Let's try and bond a little bit with, with Rebecca or Beck. We might need that later. She's going to be a runner. Oh, God, what are you crying for? If he finds out it's not his, he'll kill me. Oh, good. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's weird anymore. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. I didn't really, but you're welcome. Dinner is served. Come on, let's eat. Oh, shit, I wasted my time talking to... Oh, no, I didn't get to talk to... Oh, shit. 